Right, today's video is gonna be an interesting one because we're going to look at weight. We're going to see how much the bike weighs before and how much it weighs after a repair. So we're gonna pick the S-Works Ethios, Ethios, however you say it, which is an incredibly light frame. And we're gonna do a repair on the bottom bracket and hopefully we'll be able to show you what the weight is. And I'm hoping that the weight should be exactly the same. We'll see you after this. Let's have a look at this. Firstly, this bike has come in because it has a down tube fracture, which is a, a repair that'll be about two, three inches across, two inches there, four inches across. But yeah, substantial repair on that. So that should uh, give us a good indication of just how much difference there'll be in this frame. If you can see, but let's put that, make sure nothing is touching the frame at all. So that's definitely free. And the weight is showing 577. Let's do that again. Yeah, it seems to be settled at 577. So, yeah, we'll see what it's like afterwards. One of the interesting points to note about super light frames like this at 700, uh, 570 grams is that they use a, a very high compression mold to make this frame less carbon less resin and what resin they do have in the mold is squeezed out probably more than any other so the process is a little bit different to your standard frame in order to get this incredibly light source to repair this is equally tricky because your wall thicknesses are that much thinner and the compression of the carbon has to match the rest of the frame so whatever we're doing here the main thing is to get the consistency and the density of the carbon the same as the surrounding carbon otherwise the frame will be different and will weigh slightly differently uh, let's see what the weight is i'm expecting it to weigh uh, a little less than the original because the paint is a there's an area of paint that has to go onto that which will add a little bit more and bring the weight up to the state. But let's have a look. Um, let's set this to zero. And we weigh it the same way as we did before. Yep, uh, 576 from 577. So I'm happy with that. Hi guys, how's it going? We're going to be working on the specialized ethos today, so let's go for it. I've just been handed this frame back. If you remember, we did the weigh in, so uh, Rose has now sprayed it for us. So, really happy with the finish. I can't see it, Ross. I don't know what you did, but you did some magic there. It looks good. And so, now let's see if we still come close to the original way in which was 577, wasn't it? Okay. I'm all nervous. Oh no! We're a gram heavier. A whole gram heavier. So we failed, unfortunately. Yes, it's true. Carbon repairs are heavier than the original ones <laughs> by one gram. So yeah, good. That's excellent. That's a good result. So hopefully that's a myth buster. Carbon repairs, if they're done properly, should be very, very close to the original, but hopefully never lighter. Always should be a little bit heavier for obvious reasons. So. Uh, one gram out, I'm, I'm happy. It was one gram under after the repair was done, but that was excluding the paint. So once the paint went on, we added an extra gram and a half, two grams. So win some, lose some. So happy, happy with that.